Best communication. So if you have an application that you want to plug into the telephone network, so you have it uh, potentially send text messages, make phone calls, or receive and react to phone calls and text messages. Uh, I can continue telling about you about it, or I can have, actually show you. So everyone, get out your cell phones. This is live interactive. This is where it goes really well, really poorly. I want you to get out your cell phones and turn the ringers up as loud as you possibly can. That's the only time you'll hear that announcement this week. So the way Twilio works is that uh, for us, you purchase a phone number. What? Can I interrupt you for a second? No. I just got a call from TSC. And uh, yeah, guys, he's over here, so. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a hands-on experience. So. Sorry, they asked for it, so. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Right, I appreciate this that. Is for you. Thanks. Uh, so anyway, thanks, Raphael, Turtle. Uh, I'm not kidding, it's really for you. Yeah. <laughs> You're kind of creeping me out. <laughs> it's actually a scan of somebody's crotch. Yeah, so uh, two years this past Sunday is a. Sorry? Maybe it's the game is a scan of your crotch. Oh! <laughs> well, uh, I've never been through the scanner, so this must be your imagination. I, I appreciate it. Yeah, you, you gave me the benefit of the doubt. I sincerely appreciate that. Uh, so anyway, the way Twilio works is you get a phone number through us, and the phone number sort of acts like an IP address, so that's where the phone system routes the phone call, routes the text message. And so with that, I'm going to go ahead and get to coding. So with us, you can go ahead and you can buy a phone number. we got phone numbers all over the country. 41 different countries across the world, I believe. Um, so over here, we'll go ahead and buy a phone number, and I will buy my favorite area code in the whole world, Atlanta, 404. Plays a special place, has no a special results. place in my heart. Oh, no results. How ironic. All right, so let's go to the next one, 301. All right, Waldorf, Maryland. So we can go ahead, we can purchase this phone number, and there, we've got a the beginnings of an application. So we will use this phone number going forward for everything. So let me go ahead and grab this. Ah, there we go. So uh, the way it works, as I said, a phone number or a phone call comes in, a text message comes in, we collect some information about it, we pass it to your application. The way we pass it to your application is through these URLs. You get a URL for voice, a URL for SMS. So in this particular case, we're going to go ahead and set a URL for voice. And this is just my dream host server. There's nothing all that with me about this. And that's it. We've gone ahead and configured this number. So over here, I'm going to start some coding. So uh, the way we have to tell it it's a header, or we have to tell it it's XML, so we do content type text XML. Uh, Pete, uh, I'm sorry, Twilio makes a request to us, so we have to give it a response. So we just feedback uh, what we call Twimmel or Twilio XML. And over here, we can go ahead and we can respond with a text message. Or we have a sort of a subset of voice XML. So SMS gives you a text response. We have say, which says something. We have play, which plays something. We have record, which record. records. Hey, see how tricky this is? So we can go ahead and go with the first programming link, or the first program anyone ever writes, except I'm from Texas, so we have to do it a little differently. So. If everyone could go ahead, you should have your phones out by now. Go ahead and send a text message, any text message to this phone number. It's 301-861-3892. And now we get to see how good my coding skills actually are in front of a live audience. Give me a thumbs up when you get a response. One, two, anybody else? Hey, all right, cool, we're getting starting to get some responses. Uh, but what, what's cool about that is that we just, we just blindly accepted whatever you said and just responded to it. Now we can actually use it to do something. So we can just respond back with the actual text of the message. So we could say, you said. 
and we can echo out the body, and this just comes across as a post request. Inject stuff in the XML. So I'm going to go ahead and do a strip tags. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know what I'm being told, trust me. <laughs> All right, so now, oops. So now when you go ahead and send a response, or send any sort of message in, you should get a response back that just says, you said, and you should get back that. With that, even though we're starting on the text side, we don't have to stay there. Um, everyone thinks, oh, text, email, a voice, they're all separate. Not really in this world. In this world, we can go ahead, we can cross lines, and let me go ahead and grab this phone number again. Does anyone get a response to that one? Okay, cool. It doesn't support um, yeah, there you go. So I can go ahead and I can cross the lines and I can say, okay, well, we were responding while things were happening. Now we can go ahead and get information after the fact. So this is what everyone sent in. Hey, monkeys. Hi, stop testing. Um, I'm amazed. People actually kept it PG-13. Oh, G-rated. Guys, you make me sad. <laughs> All right, so we started on the SMS side of things. We can actually go ahead and cross over to the voice side of things. So now what it's going to do is it's going to place calls to everyone in the room who checks in. <laughs> <laughs> so when you answer, you want to go ahead and put it on speakerphone and uh, say hello. <laughs> Yes, this is all Mama one. Yeah, we did all the voice and SMS for uh, Harper yesterday. Oh, so I do not have any country enabled by default. All right. Oh, you're on YouTube. Um, so everyone should be in a couple different conference calls. You should actually hear other people before the feedback kicks in. Um, <laughs> you guys can hang up anytime. Too. Uh, and everyone should go ahead and give a text message with a thank you from me along with my contact information. So if you have any questions tonight or later on, feel free to drop me a note. And so thanks, everybody.